Summer has finally begun and fishing is on the agenda for many Tasmanians. But Tasmania's favourite fish isn't biting. Well, did you catch anything today? Nope. <laughs> what were you looking for? Um, I think we're looking for some flathead. Not many flathead. Yeah, we try uh, line fishing, but uh, not so much here. No flathead around? No, only this one small one, but it was so small we had to let it go again. An annual fishery assessment has shed light on why sand flathead are hard to come by. The most interesting and um, depressing finding this year is that sand flathead has been classified as depleted for the first time. The report finds overfishing has led to the species being depleted. Sand flathead is the most popular fish for recreational fishers in Tasmania and they take about 98% of the total catch. The biomass has been depleted to a level where we're not sure anymore that populations are able to replenish themselves. I think it, it'll come as a really big surprise to many fishers. You know, you don't expect to go fishing um, and not catch a fish, and you also rely on the government to have management settings in place that will protect the fishery. In a statement, the Department of Natural Resources said it would consider potential management options to help support the recovery of sand flathead, but didn't elaborate on whether that might mean changes to bag and size limits or temporary closure of the fishery. I believe that all fishers want to fish sustainably and do the right thing, but to do that they need information. So now that we know there's a problem, it's time to get on about fixing it. The department changed size and bag limits in 2015. This summer, it'll roll out an education campaign to inform fishers about the stock challenges. Ellen Coulter, ABC News.